Just it's another another a big defeat. It's got to be getting hard to, to take at this point, is it? Yeah, obviously. Um, yeah, incredibly disappointing, incredibly frustrating. Um, yeah, they say not just losing, we're losing by a long way and, and playing a long way, way short of our best. So um, absolutely huge disappointment. You know, presumably you've demanded a, a big response from the guys and we've heard various of, of the squad saying they're really desperate to, to put things right and put things back on track. And it's, again, you've, you've used 33 overs and 25 overs of, of the 50 in each innings. It's just something's not, not working, is it? Yeah, um, that much is obvious. Um, you know, it's never for a lack of effort. It's never for a lack of um, hard work or, or preparation. Um, you know, look around the room. It's not a lack of talent. Um, a lot of experienced guys are fantastic cricketers. So, um, absolutely, it's a huge frustration. You know, this tournament's gone <clears throat> nowhere near uh, the way we wanted to. That's been a um, yeah, a huge disappointment. Um, you know, if there was one golden egg that um, no, we were missing, then you'd hope to, to see that. Um, but uh, yeah, there, there is no uh, secret, um, I, I don't think. Um, you know, there's no one else who can score your own runs or take your own wickets. And you know, that comes from the start, from the captain at the front. You know, I've been a long way short of my best. You know, as a leader, you want to lead through your own performance, and I've, I've not been able to do that. Listen, I know, I know you can play the numbers and, and sort of try and come up with ways and means, but are England out? this tournament now oh, it certainly looks that way um, and uh, that's incredibly disappointing you know you get on the plane to to come to India and um, you know with you know in a really good position as a team you know um, everything looking like it's going to plan and um, you know it's just not worked at all um, Joss I'm probably not alone in saying that how this tournament's gone has been a shock to, to all of us I'm guessing you guys must be in a bit of shock as well given what's happened over the last couple of weeks yeah absolutely um, you know we um, you know a really good team um, done a lot of really good things uh, in the recent past in in white ball cricket uh, 50 over cricket and they say get on the plane with with high hopes and a lot of confidence and uh, belief that you know we can challenge for the title um, so to be sat here now um, with the three weeks that have been uh, is a shock it's a shock to everyone now walk back in the dressing room after this and look at the players sat there and, and think you know how have we found ourselves in this position with the the talent and the skill that's in the room but uh, it is the position we're in it's, it's the reality of, of what's happened over the last three weeks and um, yeah, it's a, a huge low point do performances like today do they make you question your own position um yeah i think um no you're always questioning as captain you know how you can get the best out of players how you can um you know get the team moving in the right direction um certainly have a lot of confidence and, and belief um in myself as a leader and captain and first and foremost as a player um but if you're asking if i should still be captaining the team that's um no that's a question for the guys above me but you're you're determined in your own mind that you can turn things around with this team and you're the right man to lead england in the future yeah uh, just uh, Sri Lanka included uh, Angelo Matthews for this team. Uh, do you think uh, that uh, inclusion of uh, Angelo Matthews uh, changed the uh, game th this time? Uh, not, not completely. Um, you know, he obviously had a really good game. Sri Lanka uh, played really well. Com completely outplayed us, and um, there was a number of their players who, who played really well. Winning that was send you all out for 156. What was your mind after all out for just 156 on this Bangalore weekend? Yeah, disappointment. Um, Joss, you were saying there's uh, there's a lack, not a lack of various things, talent, hard work, all that sort of stuff. Can you put put a finger on what is lacking? Uh, performance um, is the the obvious thing. Um, <clears throat> a lot of a lot of us have said, singled out myself to stop not performing to the level uh, you expect of yourself or, or demand of yourself as um, as an individual. So um, no, there's, there is no golden golden bullet or um, that is the, that one thing that's you know if, go off, if we do this then everything's right again. Um, no, we're just not performing to the level that uh, that we expect of ourselves that we need to uh, to compete and and uh, and play our best. And you you talk about the shock and. The dressing room down there right now. Uh, next up, you face India, who obviously been the tournament 
front runners. What what do you go and say to those players now that it looks like you're out? What what do you do? I think um, you know whoever we play next, um, you know we want to focus on ourselves. You know as individuals and as a team, absolutely keep asking questions to try and find out um, you know, what the problems are and how we can fix them. Um, and there's a hell of a lot of pride. You know, there's a lot of uh, guys who are you know, disappointed with the way they've played. Um, and I was speaking more you know, absolutely for myself. You, know, you, you feel that as much as captain and as individual. You, you want to perform close to your best. And uh, even though whatever happens from here on in in the tournament, Whoever we play, we want to play good hard games of cricket and, and play well and get back to um, playing the way we, we know we can. Um, you know, it looks like it'll be incredibly... Uh, you need a few miracles that we'd have to win every game and things go our way to, to progress further in this tournament. But um, for the games that we have left, we want to play the cricket we know we can play. Two more, Dean. One each, one each from Dean and then finish with Matt. Just one of the, I guess, ways that the players have been talking over the course of the tournament and even leading into it is that you've been there, done it before, you know what you're doing, you've had to win every game before, that it kind of be, it'll be all right on the night because of the guys that, that, that you've got. Is this kind of a lesson that actually it takes more than just having done it before? Yeah, I think um, in, in any sport or anything, you, you can't um, protect anything or rely on the part. You have to go and create something new um, every time. That's... We know that as players, we, um, you know, we touch on experience and things having banked stuff before, but um, it's something we spoke about a lot as a team that you have to go and create it again. Um, you can't, uh, you know, rest on your laurels or try and protect something, try and protect a, an image or protect something as a, a team. Um, you know, and that's why, you know, at the very beginning of the tournament, I said we, you know, we weren't here to try and defend our title. We were here to start something new and try and, and, and win something. Uh, obviously, we're falling a long way short of that at the minute. But certainly, uh, as players, uh, you know, we certainly didn't take anything for granted or just think it would be all right on the night. Um, you don't get to the level uh, like this by thinking like that. Last one, Matt. Just, do you think you've been set up to fail by the schedule and the, the, th the other things above you? Uh, no, I don't. Um, no, I think we've, you know, as, as players, um, you know, the schedules are the schedules and, and we've, we've got a lot of things in our favour. Um, we've got fantastic support, um, you know, from the coaches within that, in the uh, environment. We get fantastic support um, from our fans as a country and, um, you know, we've, we've let them all down. It's, it's been a really tough few weeks, incredibly disappointing, as you say, a shock to perform the way we have um, you know, with the the team that we do have so um, I, I don't think uh, there's any blame that less uh, elsewhere apart from ourselves and um, you know, as captain you, you sort of feel that the most.